Hi, in this video we are going to see how we can copy and fill data in Excel worksheet. And these are the things that we are going to talk about in this video. So here is a data which shows product name and then their price in rupees and their price in US dollar. Now suppose if I want to copy this data, so how I can do that? To do that I need to first select the complete data like this. So after I select my data then I need to go to home tab and then look for the group which is known as clipboard group and then from here I need to press this icon and this way I can copy the data and you can also verify it uh, if you copy something then you can see the dancing ends around the data. So this is the range that we have selected and I can see the dancing ends around it. So it means my data is copied and also the paste, open, uh, paste option will only appear when you have something copied. Then suppose this data I want to paste somewhere else, somewhere uh, where there is a space. So for this example, suppose if I want to paste my data here because there is a blank space. So how I can do that? I have an option paste here. So if I press on it, then I can see that complete data has been pasted as it is. As it is showing in the ab ab above table, the same data is pasted in the below table, right? But this is about pasting complete data with formatting. Now suppose if I want to paste data, but I don't want to paste the formatting. So how I can do that? I can use the paste special option for that. And how you can do that? So suppose data is already copied, right? So now if, if I want to paste data here and if I only want the values not the formatting then I need to press the arrow key which is or the drop down menu option uh, below paste then I can see that there are whole lot of options available for me. So from here if I only want the values then I can look for the values option. So here I have an option which is uh, saying values only. So if I press on it then you can see that only the values are pasted but not the formatting. The colors, the borders are not pasted, only the values have been pasted. Even you can see that the dollar sign or the rupee sign or the symbol are not pasted or this formatting is not even pasted, right? Now suppose this is about if you want to paste data. Now suppose if you want to paste only formatting, not the data. So how you can do that? So suppose if here I want to paste only the formatting. So I can use the paste special and I can look for only the formatting. So here I have option which is uh, telling me the formatting only. If I press on it then you can see that only the formatting has been pasted without any data. So this is how paste special is going to work and there are all whole lot of options other, uh, other than these two and you can uh, look for them also. Now, now this is all about paste special. Now how you can copy a data to one cell or to multiple cell or to multiple sheets. Suppose if you have something written over here as hello. Now if you want to uh, paste this hello to multiple cells or single cell how you can do that you need to just copy from your keyboard you can press ctrl c or you can use this button here also then suppose if you want to paste this data here then you can just paste it from this button or you can use the short key which is ctrl v from your keyboard then your hello is pasted now if you want to paste hello in multiple cells so how you can do that you can just select multiple cells like this and just press ctrl v from your keyboard or from the uh, paste button over here then you can see that all the cells that we selected now have the data or text as hello right so that's how you can actually paste or copy paste your uh, data from a single cell to multiple cells now now suppose if i want to uh, copy and paste my data from a sheet uh, suppose this hello I want to uh, paste in multiple sheet at the same time. So here I have multiple sheets right sheet number 2 which don't have any data sheet number 3 don't have any data and sheet number 4 also don't have any data. Now suppose if I want to paste hello in all the sheets at the same place and with a single click how can I can do that. I just need to select all the sheets. So how you can do that? 
press the control uh, from your keyboard, press and hold it and then click on every sheet where you want to paste your data. You can see that all the sheets have been selected. Select the cell where you want to paste your data. Suppose in cell C1, I want to paste hello. I can just press control V from my keyboard or from this paste icon. So now as you can see that in sheet 4, hello has been pasted. But what about sheet 2? If I go to sheet 2, I can see that hello has been pasted. If I go to sheet 3, hello has been pasted. Sheet 4, you already know hello is there. If you want to delete uh, this hello from all the sheet, you can just do the same. Select all the sheets and uh, press uh, the delete from your keyboard or from here. So that's how you can delete from the cell C1 in all the sheet at the same time. Now, how you can use the fill option? So using fill option for quick copying is a very easy method and it will save you a lot of time. So suppose there's a hello written over here, suppose. And if I want to quick fill this data in some cells below it or in the right direction to it. So how I can do that? I can just go to the bottom right corner of that particular cell uh, to the point from uh, when you, I see this type of icon which is the plus icon or the doctor icon, thin doctor icon, then I can press uh, click and then hold it and drag down the drag down my cursor and then uh, to the cells where I want to copy my data and if I rem uh, just remove the pressing from the uh, button then I can see that all the cells now have the same data which is showing hello. So this is quick fill. Now this is data is being copied, the same data is being copied because there is no predefined uh, quick fill uh, action available inside Excel. But for some data, there is a predefined action when you use quick fill. Suppose if I write Monday here. So as we already know, Monday is a day in our week, right? Now if I use quick fill, what will happen? Uh, most of you will think that Monday will get copied in all the cells, but no. Because Monday has or the weekdays have predefined action when you use quick fill. So if I press and hold the button and quick try to quick fill the data and if I uh, lose it, then I can see that all the data in the sequence will get copied. Like after Monday, you will get Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday and then repeat. So this quick fill option is very useful when you are going to use uh, for predefined data something like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and so on. You can use it in short form also like Monday and then if you quick fill then you can see that in short form also it is getting the same thing like this only. So this is all about copying and filling the data inside a sheet or in the multiple sheets. I hope I have not missed anything and you understood it well. Thank you.